So here we are with the Barnet Boxing Barber. Dan Winters has just stepped out of the ring victorious, come back to his team. They're all really happy. Dan, how did that go for you tonight? Yeah, I think it went well. We had a game plan and we kind of stuck to that. Um, we knew that Sam would likes to box on the back foot. He's taller, he's got range. So we had to try and nullify the jab. So just trying to get in, get out as quick as I can. I think it went well. There were some things that didn't go my way. He landed some great shots. He's a tough fighter. And I'd uh, be, yeah, overall happy with a the end result yeah you look really riled for this and look i can still see it in your face you're still in that ring right now yeah, yeah, yeah. i wait to catch you as soon as you got out what was you expecting did he give you more than what you actually thought he was going to give you 100 percent. i wasn't too sure on sam's overall fitness um so i thought if as long as i stepped up and put it on him he might disappear and he didn't he didn't he stuck in there he kept at it when i got in he, he was grabbing that was difficult to deal with so yeah it, it, good tell us a bit about your background and your journey to this point tonight in salisbury um, so yeah, basically I started boxing about sort of five, six years ago training. Uh, I always wanted to have a fight and obviously COVID and all that sort of kicked in. And then after all that sort of finished, um, obviously the lads behind me, they're all up at the boxing gym. They're all ex sort of junior amateur fighters and they got me in. So yeah, let's do this then. So they've been training me, been working hard over the last couple of years. Had my first fight last September on this night. Wow. And then I wanted to give it another go against Sam. I, I, I looked for Sam, I called Sam out. Yeah. You know, I wanted him because he looked like a good opponent for me. And that's kind of what brought me here tonight. So yeah, it's been a good journey. We're only in March, you know, what's, what's for you now? Because you're going to get a lot of, you know, you're going to feel great about that tonight. Yeah, yeah. And you're going to want to take on the world after that. Yeah, that but you know, reality, what, what is your daytime job? And what's reality to you? I mean, reality to me, I mean, my background is I'm an ex-soldier. -ex and now I'm a project manager working in government. Yeah. So there's obviously that comes yeah. to it. I'm behind a desk 95% of my time and then obviously doing this training. I don't know what's next, to be honest. I, I'm one of those that never say never, yeah. but I've got other things in my head, so we'll see how it goes. But if something came up, it was right, you know, then obviously I, I would look at taking that on. But no immediate plans right now, just no. to get what back you, what, I'm, I'm guessing you're a family man. Uh, you've got your, your, your mum, your dad, your yeah. family. Have you got any kids yourself? Yeah, I've got my daughter Eve, who's 12. So obviously all that comes with yes. being a father and obviously trying to do training and stuff like that. I've been married, been married over 20 years now. So, yeah. you know. It looks like you got caught a little bit tonight. And you know, that, that, that with some solid punches and then obviously you think, whoa, hold on a minute. I'm in a fight here and I've got to equip myself and get in and get out. Yeah, exactly that. Sam did catch me. He was very good on the jab, caught me with a lot of jabs. And then as I was coming in, a couple of low uppercuts because I was slipping those shots. But he, he knew about that. He'd obviously studied something, mm. some videos of me. And he caught me with a couple of lovely uppercuts coming in. Mm. Um, so, yeah, I did, I did get caught. But overall, I think I did enough to to win it you know it was a yeah. split decision so it was yeah. close yeah. Um, but overall I think I landed the cleaner bigger shots um, so yeah so what happens if the lad turns around and says hold on a minute I want that again I want to do it again yeah I, I wouldn't I wouldn't discount it but we'll just have to see how, how it goes so yeah yeah listen thanks ever so much for giving me an interview there you've literally just come out the ring yeah. you know you, you're still pumped up and for it well done for challenging yourself and congratulations on uh, on on winning tonight well yeah, done yeah brilliant thanks very much just okay. one last thing I just want to say a big thanks if Sam sees this a big thanks to Sam he's a tough fighter and and to his team as well professional guys mm. you know they're, they're a good bunch of lads so that's a good fight yeah you know everybody in boxing knows that you need everybody in boxing and you you need somebody to challenge themselves and jump in with you so yeah. Yeah, massive respect for you saying that. Yeah. So all the best. Like and subscribe to the Barnet Barber yeah. and keep punching. Yeah. Cheers, guys. Cheers, guys. Thanks, hey, mate. Thank you. Uh, really. Hey, well done. Yeah, cheers, well done. Thank you. Thank you for taking the interview. Yeah, no